By this he knew she wept with waking eyes, that at his hand's light quiver by her head, the strange low sobs that shook their common bed were called into her with a sharp surprise and strangled mute, like little gaping snakes, dreadfully venomous to him. She lay stone still, and the long darkness flowed away with muffled pulses. Then, as midnight makes her giant heart of memory and tears drink the pale drug of silence, and so beat sleep's heavy measure, they from head to feet were moveless, looking through their dead black ears, by vain regret scrawled over the blank wall. Like sculptured effigies they might be seen upon their marriage tomb, the sword between, each wishing for the sword that severs all.